pharmaceutical industry relies on certain materials known as excipients to formulate drugs. Unfortunately, these materials are mostly imported and are no into the import bill of the industry. What if excipients from natural sources, that is these plants or food, can come to the rescue? That is what Mariam E.I. Boachi, J.C., Ghana's first female professor of pharmaceuticals, is leveraging to help the country produce cheaper drugs. Live FM, Squishy Deborah has more in this report. After completing her bachelor's degree in pharmacy at the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology, she fell in love with the processes drugs go through before they are made available for consumption. Mariam then took up the field of pharmaceutics, a branch of pharmacy concerned with the formulation and quality analysis of drugs to help her fulfill that desire. She completed both her master's and doctorate degrees in pharmaceutics at KNUST. Because it is reported that in um, sub-Saharan African region, we spend about 70 to 90 percent of the budget, the national budget, to import drugs as raw materials or as finished products. And this is seriously affecting us in terms of um, good health and well-being. And so that is one area that my research focuses on, to use naturally um, available, locally available natural polymers as excipients and so far so good it's working and we are at various stages of development. The other aspects that we are into is quality um, control. Now there are a lot of substandard and counterfeit of fake medications in the system and I know the regulatory agencies do a lot of post-market surveillance um, to check the quality of drugs in the on the market. However, it's not enough. So one of the key things that we do is that we try our best to do this post-market survey. We pick samples of drugs from pharmacies, from over-the-counter medicine seller shops, and test them to make sure that they are up to standard. One of the earliest works, which was published in the 2012 edition of Asian Journal of Pharmaceutical and Clinical Research, focused on naturally occurring gums as recipients in the pharmaceutical industry, was promising. Professor Mariam and colleagues found that adding cashew gum to paracetamol enhances the drug's mechanical strength while not hindering how the drug is released in the body. Um, with the local excipients that we are looking into, um, so far we've done an extensive work on okra pectin and it has shown very promising results. And so the future is bright actually. And one key thing about this research is that, you know in Ghana, we have seasons for certain food products, so like yam and okra. And during the bumper season, we have them in abundance, and we have no way of storing any of it, and then in the lean season, there's nothing. It's all gone bad, left to rot on the farms.